Hey everyone, Technoment here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your Apple ID account being locked or restricted. You want to follow these steps to fix. So let's get started. The very first thing is that if you're having this issue, you want to go to your setting. And in your setting, you're going to tap on your Apple ID account here. And you're going to verify that the information you have on your account is correct, starting with personal information right here. You want to make sure your date of birth is set correctly and your name is exactly how it is for your Apple ID card that you're using. So name and then the date of birth, you want to make sure you select the right one. If you have an incorrect one, because when you set it up, you just put a random one, you want to go ahead and fix that. Now, once you fix that, you're going to go back. You're going to also go to payment and shipping. And you're going to probably enter your Apple ID password. And once you do enter your Apple ID password, you're going to see there's a billing address that I'm covering on mine. But you want to make sure that is correct, specifically for the card that you're using. So if you recently moved or that address has changed on your card on file, you also want to update it here. So you're going to go ahead and click on billing address and update it accordingly. And once you have done that, that should go ahead and fix it. Now, if it still isn't fixed, the next thing you want to do in your settings here is go for your wallet and Apple Pay and in this wallet and Apple Pay you want to make sure your cards are there but you want to see if you're using for example Apple Cash that's being restricted you want to go ahead and turn it off and on basically you're going to do that as well and if you have any restriction it'll also pop up and tell you why that was being a restriction so you can easily go ahead and fix that right here make sure that the information such as your name your social security date of birth photo ID and etc whatever they need to verify your ID you want to go ahead and submit that as well as any of those if it's not correct will prevent you from using Apple Pay all right so the next thing you want to do after that is contact Apple support you can go on any browser so I'm going to use Safari here and basically go to support.apple.com slash contact so you're going to go to this URL and from here on you're going to go ahead and navigate to more products here and then from here on we're going to go to apps and services and you're going to see apple pay right here and here you're going to go ahead and if you're seeing what's going on for example any of these that apply to you so you're going to select something like maybe transaction and payment as an example report an issue or any of this should actually work so you can say report an issue uh, and then go ahead and continue and then you can go ahead and submit a ticket. You can also call them as well. And they can also take a look at if there's anything that they do, can do to fix this. So you can submit a report or have them take a look into it by using this call option. And then it will automatically give a call or you can schedule a call as well. So that's how you go ahead and fix your account being locked or restricted. I hope this video was helpful. So please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone. We'll see you guys next time.